What's going on guys, now we've got the first pictures of Paul G. Marty doing CGI for Rhino. Now, as you can see, he's got like this massive thing around his shoulders and over his head. And it's been revealed that maybe he will be the mechanical Rhino out of Ultimate Spider-Man comics. So, that might explain why he's so big. Now, as he, he's got like this massive thing over him. And he's attached to some sort of cart that rolls on the floor. So, I'm guessing that's how Rhino gets around. Now, obviously, Rhino's going to be CGI, so that's why they need this thing. But, it looks like it's going to be pretty damn good. Now I've got someone like working on the things and stuff, he's in a suit and stuff, but here's the car that I was talking about where he's like on wheels and he's like strapped into this thing. Also, from someone that was actually on set there, they've confirmed that Rhino was actually on a rampage in this scene and Spider-Man actually jumped onto a police car and pulled out a bullhorn and started taunting Rhino, saying stuff like, you're a hippopotamus and stuff like that. Now that's pretty funny, I can't wait to see that scene, but... It's going to be good. I like how they're keeping the funny kind of parts in the Spider-Man film. That's really good. But also, which is quite strange, I think this might be in the movie where Spider-Man is like stood there facing Rhino and then a little kid dressed as Spider-Man as well runs next to Spider-Man and pretends to stand up to Rhino as well. So I think that will be in the movie. It might be like a, it might be a little, you know, mess about thing in the film. That's it for today, guys. Anyway, hopefully we'll get more CGI Rhino photos later in the week. I imagine we will. So if you like my video then hit the like button, all links will be in the description. If you want more amazing spam 2 updates then hit the subscribe button. And follow me on Instagram and Twitter and Twitch for live gameplays. So yeah, I'll see you later.